Oh, what's up, guys? So I'm just in Walmart right now, picking up a uh, getting a SD card. Just seeing, and I'm about to go get uh, notebooks. I two notebooks. I go back to school next week. So actually, when this video goes up, I will be back at school. Unfortunately, it sucks. But uh, I'm gonna cry. All right. Anyway, I'll be back at school. So yeah, just picking up SD card, two notebooks, and now I'm about to uh, go to Costco after this. So yeah, just gotta pick up some things there. And um, now I'm gonna go over here and look at something real quick. I'm just gonna, not gonna tell you what it is. I don't know if I'm gonna show it. So, all right. So I actually did pick up some oil for my car because it needs some oil, or it will. Still haven't gotten it fixed yet, but I'm still driving it because it's totally illegal to drive it. So that's what I'm doing right now. Now I needed notebooks. So let's get some notebooks. Boom, notebooks. So we're now at Costco, and let me just, okay. Yeah, so we're now at Costco, one of my favorite stores. So about to pick up some protein, AKA, I mean, protein, that's what I really mean. Pick up some protein, some other products so I can take with me when I go back to school. And yeah, so if you've never been to Costco, it's basically like a big store full of everything. Like, on steroids, it's awesome. It's probably my favorite store ever. So uh, let's go in there and let's get it. Look how far I gotta walk to get a basket. Like, can you believe that? I gotta walk way down here just to get a freaking basket? Like, come on, Costco. You do way better than that. All right, we got it right here. Muscle Farm Combat Protein Powder, cookies, and cream flavored. There is uh, 65 servings in that, and I get it for like $38. It's, it's, it's a deal, it's pretty much a steal. That's why I get it from here, and it's my, it's my favorite protein. I'm like, obviously it works, so like, And it's backwards. Cody at cakes, pancakes, protein. Like literally protein. Oh, protein, yeah, protein. So, protein. All I gotta say is protein. All right, now, I really just came to get those two things, but I may get some protein bars because they have great discounts here at Costco. So let's see. So picking up these pure protein things. Why don't you probably get these, but they're actually $5 off, so. Getting them. So you're like Camden, you're just getting protein. Yes, I know, I am. I'm sorry. What more do you expect though, really? Like, come on. I'm trying to get swole here. So now it's Friday right now. So Friday means we're deadlifting. And so yeah, I'm super excited to show you guys. Because last week deadlift felt like the best it's felt in a very long time. And so I can't wait to see how it feels today. Like I've literally been waiting for this deadlift session. For like a week, like losing sleep over it. So I'm just uh, getting my outfit ready right now. Um, I'm gonna wear tights, then I'm gonna go with the black headband today. And yeah, just doing some pre-gym, mentally tuning in to kill this session. Just finishing up my last warm-up set before I get into my working sets. So today we have four working sets, they're all doubles. You go about 80%, 86%. About 92 and a half, and then I gotta try to do a 97 and a half for a double. So I'll be like 440, 430. Just, it's how it feels. That was a, a double 370, and you can already tell it's not moving as good as it was last week. So that's disappointing. Could be a lot of reasons why, but it's gonna have to grind out the session. So next up, I got a double at like uh, 395.
All right, so that was the double at 395. I felt better, so. I mean, it's, it's just one of those things like, when you work out and like you train for strength, some days you're gonna feel great, some days you're gonna feel, not feel the same, it's just weird. It sucks, but you just gotta keep pushing through. So maybe, I don't know, I gained some more confidence back with that last one, so. Next, I'm moving on, I got a 420, a double at 420, then double at 440. So, man, got that 440 for two. That was tough, even held it at the end. That was really hard, but anyway. I moved 430 last week, like cake, and I moved 455, like for one. Felt hard too, but it actually makes me like, I know, like, shit. That first set I did at 370, it moved harder than I thought it was on me. So I was really worried about this. But I guess I got together, knocked this out, so I'm happy. So I told y'all in my last video, my goal for 2018 was to hit a 405 bench, which I think I'm gonna do. But my goal for deadlift is 600. I'm gonna pull a 600 deadlift. My all-time best was 500. I did 500 about two years ago. I trained for deadlift for a few months. I only weighed 193, 194 then. About 203, 204 now. So I'm building my deadlift back up. So I'm pretty confident I'll hit a 600 deadlift 2018. So, going for a 405 inch and a 600 deadlift 2018. And like a final thing, I think I put 540 for squat. But anyway, um, that's all I got for y'all. So uh, like the video, subscribe, thumbs up, comment what you wanna see. And um, I'll be pulling 600 soon. So, I'll see y'all around.